And what happens if I hit this one? Okay, is everything going? Everything might be going. It says chatting now. Linda White Holloway. Speak of the devil. Look at this, Linda. I'm so tickled with this, I can't even tell you. I used to live in a place that would have looked like this if it had had color, but in my mind it had color. So my places were all gray with white trim, but man, I had the best time of my life in those places, and I this just spoke to me, and I was so glad that it was available. Anyway, and look at my little kitty down there. See that kitty? There's Jelly Bean. And I don't know if anybody except my visitors is ever going to be able to see how amazing this is with all the little stuff. But it is home now. And I'll at some point let you see it hanging on my wall, but I haven't really hung my house. Let me see if I can get it to focus on there. Come on. Phew. I haven't hung my house yet like you would if it were a gallery, and it, it needs to be done that way. Otherwise, it, it's not going to look right. Ah, come on. There. All right. There. That's in focus. Anyway, I am loving this painting, and so far, only three people have seen it, and everybody has loved it. So it has found its home. And if you want to go look at it again and up close, I will be glad to photograph it and put it out there as much as I can. I'm just tickled to pieces with it. Okay, and I wanted to talk about my zine, and since I'm recording this, I know that anybody who is in it will know where to go to look for it. I'm going to be sending out um, emails to everybody who is in it. And I took a count, and I'm not sure if I have 10 or 11, because I'm not sure that one of the people is actually in it, or whether they were just calling to ask about it. So I'll get a final count out in an email to everybody, as well as the address to send all the stuff to. But meanwhile, anybody who is interested in it, I am still open for taking people on. Um, we only have 10 of us. So, oops, let me move this so I don't get it damaged. Okay, send me a note at zine to me at gmail.com. Zine to me. That's at gmail dot com. If you get in touch with me pretty quick, we'll get you in the count because so far there's there's like only a dozen of us, and and that's great too because I'd rather have twelve of us who really want to do it than thirty of us who. 15 of us don't really want to do it. But anyway, please get in touch with me if you want to do it because it's it's a fun thing and it's it's always ends up good even though you think, oh, I don't want to do that. I had um, on my last ones, this one took four days and this one took about three hours. So, you know, it doesn't have to be out of your mind kind of stuff to really be satisfying. Anyway, everybody has been doing jelly plates, and I know probably most people are a little bit bored of it, but I don't get bored of things that fast. So I'm going to do some more jelly plating. But meanwhile, I'm going to try and look at this chat because you all know I don't know how to do, I didn't know how to do this when it was working right. So I'm certainly not going to know how to do it now that it's not working. Okay. That is what that does. Okay, well, anyway, I'm going to leave this right here. Paula was doing something on her stream the other day that I was only, I was half watching because I was producing prints like mad, and it was painting on the jelly plate. And she did a coffee cup. And I don't know exactly whether it was one time through or several times through, but I found this cute thing in Fult Bolt that this is all needlework. 
but I thought this might be kind of fun to take one of these cats and try and print it through there and maybe do a couple different kinds of cats and then put them on a bigger piece of paper. So that is what I'm going to do. And if that starts to build up on me, I've got some other stuff I can toss on the papers. So, oh, and I wanted to show my, my treasure that I found at a garage sale. It's a dandelion clock. And I just thought that was the coolest thing because I've never seen one in the stamp. And this one has a couple of different, different ones on there. So yeah, must have been the season for finding these people who don't like to use their stuff. I was happy. Okay, let's see. Here's my cat, but I wasn't going to do all the little cats because I tried that and it didn't work. So I picked one. I picked that one because I like the one with the sweater on. And if I'd have been paying attention, I would know exactly what to do. But the only part that really I caught that made sense was to stick the picture underneath the jelly plate so that you know where the parts of it are. And I don't remember whether she did it like a couple of pulls on that or whether she uh, just painted it all on at once. But let me get this out of here. Oh, right. Put this down here. Let's see. Oh, and I got a couple different ones, but I figured this one will this one will work. Oops. Oh, well, I don't know what all's on there. Probably cat hair. Might be pencil lines. Anyway, I'm wearing a... Paula sent me some cute pug socks, and since they were way too small for my huge feet, I put one on my hand because I have really touchy skin, and anything that hits it seems to rip it up. So I am using this glove and enjoying it, or I'm enjoying my sock as a glove. It's kind of like a sports bra for my hand. Okay, let's see. Here's my pictures of my cats. Let me put them over here. So, all right. Have a little orange cat going on here, huh? Let's get some orange out here. Let's see. Some yellow. Okay. Oh, what else we got? What do I have here? What's this one? Can't read it. Conacrinone. Magenta. Yes, why not? Okay. Now she was painting with a Q-tip, I think. I'll get my water over here. I have a huge container of water because if it's any smaller than this, my cat will knock it over. So I try and make it a little bit intimidating. Let's see, what do I use for brushes? It's not very soft. And that's a little too stupid. Let's try this one. All right. No. Let's just get us an orange cat. Nothing better. Ooh, this is really blobby brush. Let's get this little head on here. Okay, now I couldn't really yeah, that'll work. wasn't real sure what the, um, you know, I wonder if I use this. I think I, I'm going to toss that because I think I've used that in oil paint. I'm going to stick with what seemed to be working. All right. I wasn't real sure why you would do this. Oh, no, that'll drive me nuts. what the purpose of doing this as opposed to just painting your picture on the paper was, but 
then her coffee cup came out looking pretty darn cool. So that one. Come on, let's see here. Let's get some. Let's see that I, I like the one with the striped sweater on. Nose too. Let's put a nose on it. I don't know if that helps you use this one. Yep. Let's see, we'll use this magenta. We'll stick it all on this cat. Yeah, how bad can it be? There you go, buddy. Now let's see. Oh, is it, what is this? That'll be nice. We'll put a little bit in there. What is this? That's the glazing gloss. I want this stuff though. This is the <clears throat> glazing medium, which I probably use way too much of, but I like it. I like it better if it'd come out of the container. Here we go. Alright, let's get this nice bright. I have no idea how this is going to actually play out. Okay, we need a dull color in there too. Okay, where do I stick this one in there? Alright, I suppose we should give him let's give him some bright yellow eyes. Since I have that here. Kind of like that flat top on that one eye. Let's see if I can get that going over here. Probably not too well. All right, and he's got these nice little. All right, a couple of whiskers. I kind of botched that whisker. Okay, let's see. I have all these ones that I did the other day. Let me rifle through here real quick. I'm going to stick. Oh, I did an awful lot of them in those colors, too. Okay, let's find something that isn't red. Orange. Okay, we got that. I'll try and just lay that on there and see what happens. kind of clever. We'll see what else we can come up with. All right, here's a, this over here. All right, let's add some yellow. Well, let's do this. Mix this up a bit. We'll change our cat. Make this cat a little bit wider in the face. Okay, 
things. Give the stripes a little bit. I could use the red collar, huh? All right, let's see. Where's some green? Let's go here. Oh, that's a really dark, dark green. Yellow out. Yeah. Well, you know, I don't like the shape of those eyes on this one. Let's, let's make them I'll pick some of that up. Well, that's not a very good green. But. I'm just going to fill up the hole. All right, let's see, we need to put his nose and stuff on. Let's put It. I should need my water probably. All right, let's take find a nice red. A little red in this pile. Who's red? No, that's that magenta, isn't it? No, it's a lizard and crimson. I want just red. Red, red. This looks like red. It is. Yeah, let's mm, this is so hard to straight down. Oops. It can be a goofy cat, it doesn't have to look right. No. See if we can fix these eyes a little bit. That's pretty bad. Oh, yeah, right. We've got to get that middle business down the middle of the eye, too, don't we? We'll make that purple. Oh, that could be a real disaster. We're going to make that dark green, just in case. I don't think I feel quite right putting purple right on top of that yellow. All right, let's see. We should put something else on there. Let's maybe stick some of this on there. Let's brush up. Just for the heck of it. I should probably do a couple of these like on a deli paper so they're transparent. But 
I'm not going to do that with this one. What was I? Let's see. Let me just take. Do I have a piece of wood? Hmm. Ugly papers. I'm going to grab this one. So this one wasn't too bad. Well, that's fun. Okay, I'm going to do this. Roll it out, my boy. Oops. Yes. Not with a puppy around. I'm not going to use that. Oh, that's kind of fun. I might do some more stuff on that later. All right, let's see. I'm going to just try and see what comes up. I'm going to put a little bit more on there. Uh, I take it just a, oops, maybe not use a drawing. Let's see. In here. Where's the Well, that might work into something at some point. But I think it's time to do something else on this plate, and then I'll try some other cats. Baby wipes. That's what I forgot to get. Ugh. I knew I was going to forget something. I'm going to get the purple off of here. I think I need that. I'm just gonna put this on here, grayer over it, just to sort of clean up my palette without wasting a bunch of this paint. All right, where is that? Water. Oh, I don't know what I could do. This is kind of fun on there. Let me just drop some of that on. Well, you know what? Let me just slap a few of these on there. I don't even know if those will show, but they might. This was kind of, oh man, I don't know. Let's try this. We'll just try it. 
get it off of there really fast. So this had some kind of coating on it that wanted to stick. Well, it's jury's still out. Alright, now I am going to see if I can figure out how to get into this chat thing again and see what we have going on. I'm so sorry. I would should apologize more profusely. Yes, that's my pug sock. Yes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, let's see. Man, there's a lot of talking going on here. I have no idea. I'll just go on. And you know what? I do have some flocking in there, but I'm not going to even try it. <laughs> it's probably as old as I am. Okay, let's see. Color should use more blue. But here, let me get um, let me get a different cat. Let me get my other cat. All right. I'm going to retire this kitty, and we'll try. This kitty. This one's got a little friend. All right. So here, take a sip of this. Anyway, I'm reminding you all again: if you're not in the Zine Swap, Zine to me at gmail.com. I really would like to have a couple more, but. If you're not up for it, for sure don't do it. All right, let's see. What happened with this? Oh, I see what happened. Okay. All right. Um, let's see. Will that come off? No, it does not come off. Okay. Watch out. Pencil mark stays on there for forever. Oh, that worked out. So now I have a cat face <laughs> on my thing for forever. It's a good thing I like cats. Okay. Oh, I don't want to get all that off. I wanted to leave some of that for later. Um, where's the little plastic thing? Here's this thing. Plastic thing? Where is my... Oh, that is the cat picture. Well, I'll just have to make another one. Alright. Alright, we had a cat on there. And we got sort of a get a brown cat face there and a little cat face there. Well, there's one. All right, this is Mama. I'm going to give her two paws, maybe. All right. Close enough. Close enough. All right. Now, where's that plastic thing? There. Oh, the trick will be to be able to see it through all the pencil. That's close enough. Oh, no, oh, wrong side. <laughs> and this side looks like it's loaded. <laughs> okay, uh, let me sit down for this. All right, I think I'd like to do some gray cats since I have so much. 
orange and stuff going on there. Hang on just a second. Let me turn my... Oops. Oh, that works. Oops, I just did something that I don't know that I meant to do. Hang on a second. Oh, dear God, what have I done? All right. All right, here we go. Oh, Paula, if you had a four hour nap, we're gonna be seeing you later. I'm gonna move this bucket of water. Maybe not put it on top of my stencil. Yeah, because I'm probably doing this wrong, of course. Leave it to me. I'm not really looking to see if anybody has actually told me how to do it right. <laughs> oh, I don't get mad at pencil marks. Shoot. I use my stuff. That's just a battle scar, that. Now, if it was a knife cut, I'd be mad, although I probably wouldn't be. I'd be cutting it up into pieces. Okay, do I have anything in here that I could... What do I have? That's red. All right, this is not making gray. Let me see what I have. Here. There's white. Small umber. What is this? All right, I'm gonna wipe that off. Oh, that looks nasty. That looks like ancient. <laughs> okay. Some of this going. All right. Let's see. I'm going to make some striped kitties, huh? Really sure where this is going. I think I'll put this one on. Uh, I'll do a couple of these on deli paper. All right, now let's see if Gail's going to have a better face than just stripes straight across. Let's do. Let's do some of these kind of stripes. Oh, and she's probably got a white face. We'll just come down here with her nose. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Let me get this black on here. This is bad. We can just have stripes. He's just a little boy. Let's 
Let's see. All right, I gotta think about what am I doing here? Where's the black? Did I find black? Is this it? No, that's not it. I don't see black. I'm gonna use purple. Okay. That makes it gray enough. Oh, I'm gonna want that up. There we go. Oops. I'll set that down. Let's Oh, let's see. Alright, so then I'm gonna pop a little pink up in this ear. Give it a white face. Oh, well, it might. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see what that turns into when I push the paper down on it. Okay. And I gotta put a little color on there too, don't I? Mm -hmm. Just put a little color up here. Oh, I should give her some eyes. Where's a better? That was a lousy green I had. Let's find a better looking green. might be green. Oh, look at that, it's green. Alright, I'm going to give her green eyes. Of course, I can't see what I'm doing because I'm standing in the light. That's helpful. Alright, I don't know how people do this. Seriously, I don't know how you all could come out with this beautiful looking stuff. Can't see what you're doing. Alright, let's just. Alright, what happened here? Nothing. That's the problem. Okay. Let's try and do I have a really tiny brush here? Oh, my God. oh that's pretty small. Well, not worth the try. Not worth it. Okay, let's see what we have here. We can print that on. All these reds. Okay, I'll put you on this one. I should try and catch up on this chat again. 
Well, they're cats. I can work on that. Okay. Over there to dry. Let me see what's going on here. Let's see. Um, what do you think it ought to be? There you go. Oh my gosh. Okay. Carrie, can't you borrow someone's cat? Oh. Oh, I've got too many cats. Oh my god. <laughs> no, I've got I've got five cats, but one of them is a hunter, and it's a good thing because my daughter has mice and this this is her, I inherited her cat and her cat's the hunter okay what am I gonna do with this should I just try and do one of those like white put white stuff on it and pull it off let me try that is this white this is white okay let's just put that on there oh but no I'm supposed to be using craft paint if I'm doing that Ooh. Nuts. Okay, well, you know what? We're doing it with this because it's on there. That had gold on it. We could live with that. We can live with the gold on there. This is way a lot of paint. But that's it. Right. Let's see what we can do. Let's, let's grab some of this stuff over here. Here, I don't mind wrecking a piece of paper. I'll do that. Just, just for grins. Oh, man, I'll tell you, one of my friends has gotten, I don't know what, what's happened, but all of a sudden I'm getting all these weird... Uh, messages from some pro from uh something she's signed up for a sales thing so i'm getting all these notifications for walmart coupons or something which is great except i don't want them right now well that's terrible um but it'll turn into something i'll tell you after that last one was kind of a disappointment this one this was other one was pretty good. Okay, let's see. Let me try and should I try, let me try another cat. What the heck? Okay, hey, I've got a calico cat. Let me try one of those. Okay, where is something here? No. I still have some of my coffee. Yes. I have to savor it all day. All right, what am I doing now? I was gonna do a calico cat. Let me get some more orange out. Okay, let's get some more chicken. Drink some coffee. I wish I had, I wish I could have more. Hmm. Now what is, is that the same?
how do you turn this sucker off? <laughs> I don't know. I'll just uh, manage. All right. Let's see. I didn't get the. Oh, that's dirty. I gotta clean this up. All right, kitty, where are you so I can look at your spots? She's hiding. She spent the night in the garage last night hunting. And I let her. She enjoys that. She comes back in with webs and stuff all over her face and just happy as can be. Man, that cat loves the wild. Let's see. Where did there is this the white? No, it's purple. That's why I keep using it because it's out. Okay. All right, get a little of that. Did I ever find the white? I did find the white. I just used a bunch of it. All right. Well, here's some white. I'll just. I need more than that. What's this? That's white. Alright. Alright, where are the colors? She's black. Did I ever find the black? Oh, God. <laughs> Blue. <laughs> Blue. The purple. <laughs> okay, we're going to pretend this is black. <laughs> I wonder if I even, I'm sure I have black. Let it go. <laughs> All right, we're going to do this cat. I never put the colors out here. And there's the orange. She's not really that got this bright of orange, but then again, she doesn't have purple either. All right. I'm going to give her a white face. And her name is Freckles, so we're going to give her some freckles. Let's see. And she's a girl. We'll give her the pink nose. Like that. And she has a little bit of white over here. She has white down the middle. And she's got a lot of not white. She's got a ton of black, so we're going to pretend that this is black. Okay. Give her a little thing here. Gonna go right straight through this middle section with some orange. She's got some on her. And she knows that she's flashy. Hmm. 
Alright. Close enough. I can't see that. I mean, you put this down so you can see where the drawing is on the underside of it, and then you have the depth of the glass, so you can't really see what you're doing anyway. Get this side here. This is black. There's some pink. Oh, I like some pink in her ears. What's this? Could they make the writing any smaller? Where's that obnoxious pink? Is this it? Yeah. That stuff's good stuff. I wonder what that actually is. Why was I mixing this pink? Oh, for the ears. Okay, gotcha. And she's got the Marvelous green eyes. And in the absence of black, oops, stuff is weird to work on that jelly plate. I'll tell you, it'd be easier to do it on paper. <laughs> ah, I'm gonna give you round. Oh no, I'm not. I'm gonna make them slow for the whole game just because the paint looked it up there. All right, she's got white whiskers. Oh, I did a lousy job on that, but that's okay. All right. I'm going to use some belly paper on this one. Okay. Let's see, maybe I can... No, I'm just going to leave it. Mm. Again. Well, I can work with that. Here we go. Let's see. Do I have a decent... This is a decent one. 
Let me just you know what I wish I could spot here? It's my water spray. Somewhere I know I've got a water spray, but it certainly doesn't seem to be sitting right here. That's bad news. And so so. So so. Yes, I know what startled you. It startled me too. What she heard, but she she woke up, woke up in a fit. All right, let's just. Oops. What color is this? Let's see what can we do some of this color that I have here. I can put a porcupine sun on here. No, no, no good. Not happy with that one. There we go. We'll do something else with that. Okay, now I should probably see what's going on here. Okay, let me see how you do this. Oh, you just have to scroll. I should know this. All right. Oh, I'm sorry. That's my 13 year old Shih Tzu that just let fly. We didn't even hear from the puppy. It's because she's busy eating a roll of paper towels. Aren't you? Here, I'll take that. Thank you very much. Here's your bowl. There. No, she must have heard something going on outside that I didn't hear. Okay. Let's see what we've got. We've got some oddball stuff, but you know, it'll be fun. I'll be able to do something with that. But I'm not sure I understand. I think what I'm supposed to do, or I think what I could do, is continue to print 
on the deli paper, you know, just keep printing on there. And maybe I'll figure out why I would do that. But probably not with this little piece. But I'll, I'll think of something. I was going to actually try and put them, um, if I was to do it on deli paper, I was going to put it on canvas with uh, matte medium. But I don't know if this uh, prints very well on canvas. I should probably get rid of what's on there now. Let's see, what did I do? Oh yeah, craft paint. All right, how about I use, I have some craft paint over here, but it's, it's pink. Okay, I'm going to use, I'm going for the pink craft paint. Oh, that is awful. That is really bad news. Some ugly paint. there's enough nonsense on there to really even get anything much to pull off of it. You might just mess around with it while it's seeing as it's sitting here. Let's see. I like this stuff. This is kind of a textured piece of, it's not really cardstock. Okay, I'm going to pick this up. Let's just do this. with that. Yeah, I suppose I can take my happy little cats out of there. There. I need that confusing jumble. <laughs> that works. Let me put these in a book. And meanwhile, I'm going to scrape some of this stuff onto here. And brush it in. Oh, here I got the brayer. did find my water bottle, didn't I? I found an empty one. Let me put some water in this. Seriously, it holds all of about seven drops.
There. Well, I used some of that. Let's see. What else have I got here? I can coat with paint. Mm -hmm. I'll put some of the rest of this over here because I did grab up an awful lot of it. I'm sure somewhere along the line I'm going to really be glad I've got that on there. I can't quite at least it's on somewhere. Let me get a flip this. Let's see. All right, now what's going on? What is this? What is this in the middle here? With the peas. Oh, that'll be fun to mess around with someday. I got more than enough oddball things to mess around with. But anyway, that's me not being bored with the jelly plate yet. Okay, now where is the mouse? The mouse, the mouse, here's the mouse. Okay. Let's see. No. All right. Be challenging homework. Oh no, Dar's passing out homework again. Okay. Oh, I do not have a clean table. That's for sure. Well, again, anybody wanting to do the zine swap, zine to me at gmail.com. I, I will let you in. I will let you in. And if you're from another country, I will mail your zines back to you. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to send out um, emails to everybody who 
did say they wanted to be in it to let them know the address to mail stuff to. And the instructions are the same. Just take your zines to the post office and see how much they cost and put the stamps on them. But if you're in Canada, don't bother because I'll send yours and that's no problem at all for me. And um, pretty much anything you want to do. Oops, that, that is terrible. I hope you could see better than that. No. Not that there was anything really to see, except me drawing primitive cats. Anyway, thank you so much for coming. And I hope to come back on again soon. I'll find a time when it's, it's easy for everybody to get to, hopefully, except unless it's like 4 o'clock in the morning, which is when I almost did it. And I thought, no, that's not right. Anyway, I enjoy you all, and you all inspire me no end. And I want to just make sure everybody knows that it, I do art along with you, and I really appreciate the conversation that I get from each and every one of you. And thank you much for coming. Okay, I'm going to see if I can figure out how to save this mug. And I'll see you all at the next stream. I, I hope Paula streams tonight. She, she slept. Eileen, you need to stream. <laughs> That's all right. That's all right. We'll talk to you all soon. Okay, I need to hit save. All right. And I need to, I don't really know what else I need to do. Go to the menu. All right, I'm in chat. I need to stop this. Okay, and then I stop.